So, welcome everybody to a brand new video and today we're going to be talking about an interesting topic that I haven't gotten into it like at all. It's and it's about relationships, you know. Um and I'm just going to be starting out with um, relationships with a uh, partner of yours, you know. Why you should have it, you know, the upsides of it. And I think it's a great team to talk about since I know some people are still stuck on it. I was also stuck on it. Like, should I have one or not? You know, but then I definitely got into it. And now I have a beautiful girlfriend. And, yeah, I think it's more of a benefit most of the time. And we're going to get into the actual reasons why later. But I just wanted to give, like, a quick announcement about... So, I've been sick for the past, like, a few days. And I haven't been posting much, and I apologize to everyone, but um, I'm trying to keep my cool, but um, I just have like a real bad um, cold, I'm trying to like actually fight it, but it's kind of hard, but I'll try to keep up the, you know, like three videos a week at least this week, and I hope I can get back to like two, every two days a video, since, you know, I'm still trying to do my best, I haven't been much working on myself since everything hurts but if you want to know more about that just come on to the discord talk to me and yeah let's get into the facts so a big factor of mine is is probably just gonna be the motivation that comes with the person right or with a partner because i get motivated a lot and i'll probably even started this all because of her you know it's an interesting topic to talk about because I don't know where I will be without her, you know. Because it's just not as easy to get motivated. I, I mean, in my part of the world, I didn't get motivated easily. But now it's like easier because, you know, I have someone a little easier. And it's one of the best points because, you know, even if you don't want to go to the gym, you're like, I have a girlfriend, you know. She wants me to look nice. I got to go there destroy the machines and that's all, that, that's what it's all about you know i didn't know this feeling but it propelled me into a bigger motivation where i'm just like you know i'm working for her but also for me you know but like the motivation because sometimes i cannot get just myself to motivate myself and it's kind of hard sometimes when i'm thinking about it and i'm just giving myself excuses it's like the fight or flight and I'm just like should I fight it or flight you know should I just go to the gym or stay at home and do something else you know like sleep and then uh, at the end of the day I mostly just you know go to the gym because I have a motivator and that's the thing you know I find someone um, as a good person as mine it's definitely gonna help you in the long run and you gotta um, also you know a second point, you got to look out for the bad ones because you don't want to be with those ones. You know, people, you know, girls that don't believe in you. I mean, it has happened, you know. And they were just laughing in my face. I was just like, nah, you know, I'm going to make it. And then I got mine and I was like, you know, she believes in me. And that is the difference between some of them. Most of them, you know, most of them are just like there. You know? They don't do anything. They don't believe in you. They don't want to even text you sometimes. But if you find the right one, the soulmate, as we call it, it's going to help you a lot to propel you into a, a better state of yourself. And you're going to be in be the best state because you got someone, you know, as the good things. But all you got to do is keep, lo keep looking. That's a good thing, right? Because you never want to give up. So you don't want to give up on your first one because it was a bad one or a second one. You know, you might get sidetracked and do some, something else and you will be just like, you know, I got to improve myself. But then most of the time, you know, just you just come back to it. Even though you're just like, mm, you know, so as I go into it again, I'm risking, you know, like some time of my life. But I'm just like, it, it will be worth it. And after a year, it's definitely paid out for me. Like less of a year, but. The point is, it's it's a big like asset I could say to you. Like it helps you propel into an amazing state of mind, because you know, you know, 
you just know it in your head and you're like you know that is the one and i don't know how to choose that but you just have a feeling you know it's different and i'm not like any relationship advisor i'm just here to tell you my story of it and why well, never gave up and now know uh, that i should not give up always i used to give up and i was like <laughs> nah but now i'm just like you know i'll never give up because i know that i can change the faith of you know me and many others and i don't even like to call it a faith a faith because i most of the time just don't believe in it i'm like you know there's for certain things yes it is but not for all because you can change some things right if you're a homeless guy you could just change it to be a billionaire I'm, i mean a millionaire you know or a billionaire it has happened probably to someone it has and it's just the drive that keeps you going you know the motivation where you're just going like 90 degrees up and you know you made it or like you're making it you know and once you get that momentum it's like a rocket you know like a rocket you just keep going up like there's no stopping because you don't want to stop you see the finish line it's over there you know my first client i'm making it and i will make it kind of got sidetracked but it's the power of motivation and just having a person that believes in you cares for you you know is there for the bad times and it's many other things that it's hard to explain but you just have a different feeling with them because you know you have the feeling of just knowing that that is a person that is right for you you might get like kind of switched feelings sometimes you know you want to be with a girl and the next day you don't want to be with a girl that has happened in my previous relationship sometimes but now it's totally different right like i always want to be with her but it's, it's just the main thing that you get to spend um time with a person that you know is not just there like a friend you know i, I still have some we could say good friends right very good friends that kind of help me with the gym and everything and you know the who the homies are but it's different with a girl because or you could say with a partner because you know there might be girls watching i didn't think about that until um my girlfriend told me about it and i was like right you know it's gonna be just about why you should have a partner not about just you know having a girl because that's different you know there's some you know they're not all the same and it's the same with genders and I just wanted to talk about it because it was a, it's a it was a, like a nice thing. I was like laying in bed with her and I was just like, yeah, I'm going to film that video, you know, because it might change people's lives. I was stuck in that place one day and I was like thinking, it is good or bad. But I found out that it's all the good things that could happen. It's kind of different when you have a family that believes in you. And when you have friends that believe in you because they're the same, you know, family is from, like, you're a big family, you know, you're from, you come from the same thing. So, you know, people have to believe in you kind of because you're in the family, right? And you have kind of, uh, you know, different kind of connections with the person, like the blood and all that. And then you have friends, which are like, you know, mostly they're, you know, all my friends are male. Um, and it's just different because, I mean... To get an attention of a opposite sex, we could say. It's it's hard, you know, and for them to believe in you, that is only a handful of people do that. Like it's in the percent, very small, like it's like a very small percentage. And I've been there and it, it's different, right? When the girl actually believes you. I mean you kinda got sidetracked a lot today. I just wanted to express my feelings on what I think about relationships and why you should be looking for the one. I mean, it will take you time. It depends. If you want to be a loner, then that's your thing. You know, you can just focus on yourself, king or queen. But, you know, sometimes you just feel like you need that one person. I always felt that I was like alone. I was just thinking about it. Like, I need someone like that. 
that's how it happened. I mean, it's a whole gigantic story where I think we'd be telling it for hours. And yeah, that's where I'm going to end this. If you liked the video, if you enjoyed the video, my I mean, just like it, subscribe, turn on the notify bell if you like watching my content and comment down below what you liked about the video. If you have any video suggestions, drop down in my Discord. If you feel like you got any, you know, any thoughts you want to share with me, any improvements or anything, just, I'm most of the time I'm free. So you can just like have a chat with you. But yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Have a blessed week and peace.